The state of California is seeing an uptick in avian influenza cases in humans. I'm Sam Hoyle, your neighborhood reporter. According to a press release from the California Department of Public Health on Friday, there have been six confirmed cases of avian influenza in humans, all of them in the Central Valley. While the State Department of Public Health has not disclosed the individual counties where a human has contracted the virus, Kern County Public Health confirmed that one of the cases falls inside county lines, marking the first confirmed case in Kern County since the highly pathogenic avian influenza outbreak began in 2022. So this is the first confirmed case in a Kern County resident. You know, since, since the outbreak started in 2022, we've had residents who've been exposed, potentially exposed to sick animals, you know, even when it was in wild birds, in poultry, in other states, because we do have people who travel who work in other places. In a release from state public health, all six of the cases in California stem from infected dairy cattle and quote, evidence continues to suggest only animal to human spread of the virus in California and quote. Kimberly Hernandez, the division director for county public health, says while cases may be rising, the risk to the public is relatively low. But if you're someone who works around animals that have the potential to be sick, to take proper precautions to avoid spreading the virus, like wearing personal protective equipment. And the risk to the general public remains low. We do want people to to be vigilant, you know, if you work in a, around animals that might become sick, to take those precautions, you know, and to be have we call that low threshold, you know, for concerns about symptoms, because like I mentioned, a lot of people have reported conjunctivitis. So not necessarily what you think of as like a flu like symptom all the time. They didn't have necessarily a fever or a cough or a runny nose, um, but that if you're in contact with those animals, if you start to get red or itchy eyes, you know, to kind of think about the fact that it could be the bird flu. Hernandez did say that if you are working around animals that you do suspect are sick and then you get sick to contact your primary health care provider to rule out other illnesses and the county health department to determine if other testing is necessary. In Bakersfield, I'm Sam Hoyle, your neighborhood reporter.